So, No Way Home has just released a new trailer and I did a reaction to it. I've watched like a million breakdowns of this one trailer alone, this one mi three minute video, and I feel like I noticed some more stuff that's been left out of all the other trailers, so yeah, that's why we're here, because I'm going to break this trailer down. I know s I am obviously going to repeat something that you've probably already watched, because... I mean, like, at this point, there's, like, so many trailer breakdowns that it's kind of hard not to repeat. So the first shot of the trailer is of Peter in the rain, and this could be him grieving after someone died. And the trailer kind of makes it look like MJ's gonna die, a grin Stacy, but I think Aunt May's gonna die. And the trailer kind of also hints at this. I'll get into why later. And the Iron Spider suit gets his nanotech destroyed in the Doc Ock fight scene. Kind of like Iron Man's in Infinity War. I know everyone said this already, but Doc Ock says, You're not Peter Parker. To Tom Holland. And this is like our first big hint that Tobey Maguire will show up. Like, I noticed this myself because I watched the trailer a million times, frame by frame. And I noticed how when Doc Ock throws his arm as Peter, he had his glasses on, but when he talks to Tom, they're off. So this could be either a continuity error or like trailer being deceptive. The trio laugh at Doc Ock's name, and this is obviously a reference to Infinity War, when Peter and Strange had a similar exchange. Hey. Doctor Strange. Oh, you're using your made-up names. Um, I'm Spider-Man then. Peter's black suit is filled with Strange's magic, and this lines up with the, like, toys and, like, a lot of leaks. How, uh, Doctor Strange gave him this suit to, like, either trap the villains. I've heard some leaks say they trap the villains, send them back to, like, in this case, it's Electro, so, like, send him back to the TASM verse, or send him back to the Sanctum. And also, one thing that's interesting, we only see Tom, Peter, fight Electro, Doc Ock, and Green Goblin. But we don't see him fight Sandman and Lizard. And we see the Lizard from the first trailer in Doctor Strange's basement. So I'm thinking maybe Doctor Strange fought the Lizard and caught him and then like trapped him in the basement place. But we don't see Sandman, so yeah. Maybe Strange or, uh, and I really like this. Daredevil catches the lizard for Strange, or like, Strange just does it himself. Everyone has pointed out at this point, Doctor Strange acts like an asshole. So, Scooby-Doo this crap! And, do I even need to explain myself? Doctor Strange is Mephisto, and uh... Well, if you, if you haven't heard of that by now, um, whatever you've been doing since like, last October, like October 2020, when WandaVision kind of hinted at Mephisto in its trailers and stuff, but like seriously, at this point, how have you not heard the Mephisto theory? Like everything, Mephisto and Wanda, Mephisto and Sam Bucky, Mephisto and uh, Loki, and then I think in What If, and now No Way Home. <sighs> I don't think they're gonna show Mephisto to be honest. I think he's more likely to show up in Doctor Strange because that's more like Spider-Man in the comics. He's more like a street level hero, and like Doctor Strange is like well, one of the most powerful beings in the MCU. And also Doctor Strange is gonna deal with more like mystical threats, and Mephisto kind of fits the category. But I know about that one more day storyline where Peter goes to Mephisto, so yeah. It looks like his tentacles are being held back by Stark Tech. Yeah, this is what I meant earlier with Aunt May dying, because there are a lot of leaks that Green Goblin kills Aunt May, and in this trailer we see Aunt May holding some kind of green device. It's the same lobby where, like later, we see Green Goblin bomb the bomb the place with one of his pumpkin bombs. So Aunt May could be either running away from Green Goblin, and like that green glowing thing is probably related to like goblin tech she looks like she's holding a knife and that might be her saving peter a lot of people have pointed it out but it looks like they edited tom holland's iron suit onto one of the other twos because in like one frame you have to watch this frame by frame to notice this in one frame you can see the eyes of whoever the heck that is and the eyes don't look like Tom Holland's eyes. It looks like one of the other two's. Electro's new suit is extremely comic accurate compared to whatever the heck that was in TASM. Statue of Liberty is surrounded by scaffolding. There's also a leaked suit for Queen Goblin. And we, we saw this in the, tra in the first trailer, but Happy looks on. And this might actually be his reaction to Aunt May's death, because... 
yeah, the two have a very complicated relationship. I know everyone on the internet has been pointing this out already. <sighs> the lizard gets punched by someone or something in the Brazilian trailer. In the English trailers, they don't like, they cut it just before we see the lizard get hit. And my theory, actually everyone's theory at this point, is uh we see Tom Holland or what looks to be Tom Holland charging at Sandman there's like electros above Sandman and lizard underneath and the two others are just charging at nothing like I don't, like I, no one would ever do that no one would just like randomly jump at nothing why would anyone do that so and yes lizard does get hit so it's pretty obvious that they CGI someone out it's probably Andrew fighting the lizard. Uh, there's someone's arm next to Ned. Third Spider-Man love injured. Actually, fourth one, because Liz from Homecoming also fell. Marvel is doing this again. First with Gwen Stacy, and then Natasha in Endgame, and then Katie, and now MJ. As Cinema Sins once said, Mary Jane is in some sort of danger cliche. I know her name's not actually Mary Jane, but still. We see, just before the title of the movie, we see someone's hand holding uh reaching out to mj and everyone's already said that this is, has to be andrew redeeming um gwen stacy or whatever 